Hey y'all, we're back. It's uh, Sunday, August 7. I'm out here at Rich's place messing around with that uh, seat form we foamed up yesterday. Just want to, uh, as I'm going, I just wanted to touch base and, and show you some of the little uh, some of the little tricks. I know you you look at you look at the way it looked yesterday, and you're like, oh gee, how how is that ugly wrinkled uh, uh, unproportionate thing going to going to work, right? And, and uh, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring you along step at a time and treat you like a student, so uh, so you can. I'm, I'm trying to get this glove off. So you can see the, the transformation of this thing. And uh, as, as you compare, uh, you know, part one to part two to part three to now four, five, six, seven, as we go, um, snapshots, right? Video snapshots of, of how, this, how this plays out and how I see it in these snapshots right from what you saw yesterday to a finished piece. Um, it's a gift. Uh, I, I didn't go to school and learn it and practice it. I did go to school for modeling um, and, clay, and clay, but um, I already had, a, I, already ha I already had it. I already had it in me. Um, the, I think that's why I was, I was relatively good at doing body work and, and, and my spray painting came naturally and what have you. But uh, enough about me. Here we are um, fixing, fixing, working things up, right? We did uh, just, just a rough trim uh, of what we had we, you know we kind of drew that line where we showed you where the natural bit of the seat was at here we're we're building up some blocks to fill in where we you know and sometimes you just you just got to cut it right out and make it square and we're gonna have to clean that up some more you know because it's not but uh, we'll go ahead and, and we'll be able to glue these pieces in place right and 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 add some radius to it and in some shape uh, what really really wanted to show you is this stuff here. We're, all this garbage we're cutting off. Some of the stuff we're keeping that we know we can use for uh, for different things. I mean, this is really kind of what I started with right here. These pieces here, um, and and you can run it run it through the saw and uh, cut them down a little thinner. Um, these are just what what these are going to do is give us uh, a hard edge, right? As you can see here, look at all this that's missing. Now you could, you could do like Legos and build it straight up and then start hogging it all out. Or you can just give yourself a line, a definitive line. How do I know that this, this line is, well look, I went over here and kind of fit it up over here first. Um, now you could go ahead and cut this stuff, cut it round and stuff, but these pieces were just like this. They were dead straight and I'm going to show you with this lighter, how I'm, I'll, make, I'll, I'll kind of make this one fit over here. Um, not only can you bend them, you can add sweep to them as well. This one here was another straight, dead straight piece. So what we'll do is we'll get this stuff close, and then with sandpaper or the 90 with the abrasive on it, we'll, we'll sand this to fit this stuff here. It's just warming it up with a lighter. You don't burn it or melt it. You just warm it up and you bend it, and then you blow on it, and then you, you heat it up and bend it and blow on it. So uh, let, me, uh, let me run you through this real quick. Put you right here so you can see behind me over here when I walk over to the deal. It's just a matter of just uh, warming it up, right? Just get her warm. Doesn't take much, except when the fan's blowing on it. I'm telling you folks, there, this is why I love model making, because there is no, oh, this is the absolute way to do it. There's no wrong way to do anything, and you just start moving it. It's going to be a little bit at a time, right? You're going to, we need to warm it up a little more. The wind is really playing against us here. But I want to show you this because if I just told you, you say, oh, no, that's a, he just cut that out. But um, you see, it starts bending. Now it's going to bounce back a little bit, but look, right? And you, it's, you just keep working on it. Well, the breeze blowing through here is really messy. You should, I mean, it's probably be a lot easier with like a hair dryer or something, you know? Just something, I mean, it doesn't have to be smoking hot. You just got to warm it up. Oh, I broke it. You just got to warm it up so you can, so you can move it. 
think I didn't get it hot enough. This breeze here, let me see. Yeah, I'll put it up here so you can see. See? Well, I think we gotta go a bit more. This piece here is still pretty stiff. I mean, we can you leave it there because you, you're gonna body work this stuff. You're gonna sand on it and form it and round it up and what have you. Again, it's just to give you uh, uh, an edge to fill clay from, you know, and of course you can sand it back, you can change it, you can alter it. Let's go see how this piece fits. And we're just, you just saw me, I just did that right here for you. And, uh, oh gee, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Don't break your arm back yourself on the back, Robert. But uh, that's the eye. That's the eyeball. And you get this, folks from repetition uh johnny west just talked to john he's uh him and joe back at the hotel having some dinner uh he was in assen holland uh uh safe flight back home john um he did really well over there I'm, I'm i'm really proud of him uh out of 42 starters in in three different classes um two twin classes two twin cylinder classes and one single um overall finished 15th and uh, 13th in his class so not a bad gig there was 29 guys i think in his particular class uh the straight up division one so uh not still not bad man that ain't bad that's pretty darn good i'd be proud of myself go over there and and race with some of these these big boys and these these fellas that uh you, you see if you watch his facebook page um he walked around and showed you these people tear, they're just like roger penske they tear these go-karts down man in between practice sessions and qualifying and, and in between races and stuff. I mean, they're serious. They take their go-kart racing serious, even though it's a hobby for them. So um, we're messing around. We're just, we're just playing games. You know, like I said, as you see, there's a big void here, right? All that big void. All this does is give us a projected point to just pat clay in there and fill it. Uh, could, could we fill it in with foam? Yeah, but we'd have to carve and sand. It's easier to do flat surfaces, on one on top of another on top of another, uh, than it is to do funky surfaces, round or, or whatever. So with this here, I mean, that is, that, that's a pretty extreme bit, but we haven't started, we haven't started washing the inside of this thing down yet either. All these lumps and bumps, it's all gonna get smoothed out. We know, you can see the natural curve around my rear end here, right? This is the hip. This is waist. This is uh, chub right here. Love hand, love handle right here. <laughs> I know like that, Glenda. That's pretty cool. Um, so I mean, I, I know exactly what I'm looking at, and uh, I, I'll be able to work this in a bit. Not much. We take it down a bit just to start get a uniform radius and surface, and then we can fill the little voids in with clay. Get us a nice consistent surface uh, as we go. As you see, this thing start coming to life. You're going to think, wow, man, that's pretty cool. I could do this. You can. You can do it yourself. Um, you have nothing to fear but fear itself. I mean, if you fail, so what? You know, it's, 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 it's a toy. It's a hobby. We're playing around here. So you can do this out in your garage, too. Or come on over to Rich's garage. You can make a mess of Rich's garage with me. But, uh, that's it for now, folks. Just wanted to show you how we're going to fill these pieces up that, are, that are, were just not there. Uh, especially these big pieces here and uh, and how we're gonna how we're gonna fit this all together and and get us a nice form fitted seat out of this thing so uh hang in there a few more steps to go but uh we're playing around on sunday hang in there go to church i was this morning i'm gonna go back and hit evening church too but um get right with your creator because he's the coming i told you it's gonna get better and that's exactly what i mean you know it you know who i am by now Godspeed. God bless. We love you all. We're praying for you.